New information on the dog that died aboard a United Airlines flight. A grieving family is speaking out about what happened. They say a flight attendant forced them to put the 10-month-old French bulldog in an overhead bin. He was a really special dog, and it's just sad how the way he has to just sleep. For 11-year-old Sofia Caballos and her mother Catalina Robledo, Coquito was a part of the family. We, we took him everywhere we went. On a United Airlines flight from Houston to New York Monday, Robledo put her dog in a carrier. She struggled to put Coquito's carrier under the seat in front of her. The family says a flight attendant insisted it go in the overhead bin. My mom's like, it's a dog, it's a dog, he can't breathe there. And she's like, it doesn't matter. She felt the dog and she put him up there. The family says they heard Coquito barking for two hours, then he stopped. They wanted to check on him, but could not. We tried, but like there was a lot of turbulence and we, we weren't allowed to stand up. We trusted her that he would be fine up there. When the flight was over, they found Coquito had died. A fellow passenger posted a photo of Coquito saying, my heart broke with theirs as I realized he was gone. My mom was crying. She was like, screaming there, looking at him. In a statement, United says this was a tragic accident that should never have occurred, as pets should never be placed in the overhead bin. We express our deepest condolences. There is no circulation at all in there. Retired airline captain Denny Kelly says the pitch black overhead bin is dangerous for any live animal. They're scared. Their heart rate goes up and uh, they use more oxygen. And if there's not enough oxygen in the first place, that just makes it worse. The flight attendant told the airline she did not know there was a dog inside the bag. She's been described as distraught over what happened.